the coronavirus pandemic affected your mental health? What do you say? Um, well, I'm a bit of a unique case because uh, just before the outbreak, I was planning with my doctor to bring my dose of antidepressants down. So I was starting to work on that, and then all of this happened, and just like the stress of losing some of my work and having to stay in, we decided we'd put that on hold and just just stay on the dose of one for now. I suffer with anxiety. Um, I don't like being out of control of the situation, so this definitely has rattle my nerves a bit and I've struggled to sleep and adapt to just being stuck at home all day so yeah it's it's quite difficult to be suffer already. Do you think that it's kind of like made your mental health worse at times? Definitely at times I mean whilst I'm working from home and I'm busy it's it's good but even then because I'm a journalist I'm reporting coronavirus all day for about eight hours on a shift you're thinking about it all the time and it can like it's making my stomach tight and it makes you nervous and just feeling down so yeah it's definitely affected my mental health and probably yeah well well has made it worse um but you know there are things I do as well to try and keep it you know keep myself up beat and busy and that's the main thing yeah um, are there things that you found that help you the most when you start to get that anxiety? Yeah, so um, definitely just switching off from social media. Obviously, part of my job is you're constantly on social media. So just really taking a break from that. Um, just literally sitting with family members and having a chat or finding a sense of laugh about helps. Um, I do yoga at home. Try and walk the dog as well to get out, and I just, you know, I've turned to some of my little hobbies that I don't usually have time for, so things like crochet, um, doing colouring, <laughs> <laughs> like really childish things, but just things to keep me busy and distracted. So, have you? I know you've been working from home. Have you been able to keep your mental health in check now that you're working from home? Um, yes and no. Um, to start with, it was um, it was a bit of a novelty to be told work from home. You know, you don't have to get up and go in and get dressed or go anywhere. And then it went to a stage of this is really miserable because I'm not seeing my colleagues. Um, we're working remotely, and all we're reporting on is coronavirus. So, yeah, it it drags you down. It does. Um, you know, after I finish my shift, they come downstairs to my family. It's just like, oh feel very dragged down and drained by it but um on the whole I know what to do to control my anxiety like a, a, you know things I've mentioned doing yoga meditating reading crochet coloring whatever it just things to distract <laughs> is there anything that you would recommend other people that suffer with mental health issues like different things they could do yeah, I mean, it sounds very cliche, but exercise is really important. So even if you just get a YouTube video up and do some yoga at home, that can really help. Um, if you've got a dog, that's a perfect excuse to go out for a walk. A lot of people are cycling at the moment as well. Um, just get on your bike and go somewhere. And switching off from social media is a big thing. 